Ladies and gentlemen, the greatest chess match of all time has just occurred. I'm not talking about Magnus Carlsen, Hikaru Nakamura, Jan Nepomnishi, or Ding Li Ren. Today's match was played between Frank and Orbital Racer. These two are TikTok chess sensations, and this match was put together by none other than Sean, aka Chess Tactics. This is the highlighted version of the full match, which took place on my Twitch channel. Oh, and if you wanna follow any of these people, the links are in the description. Drop them all a follow, here we go. And Frank is just pounding E4, oh, and there, there it we is. go! There it is, E4, it's game E5. on, folks. Frank has been studying- THE oh, BONE CLOUD! Oh my goodness. Frank has played the bong cloud in game one. And Orbital has not responded with the mirror bong cloud. There is no gentleman's agreement. This is like if oh. one man offers a glove touch and the other one declines it. It's LeBron game one now. dunked on Michael Jordan on move two of game one. This is spectacular stuff. Knight to F3, pawn to D6. Now, hopefully Frank, Frank is actually trying to win the match, right? He's not just trying to make memes. Oh yeah, he's there. This is a, this is a match to the death. There is lots of blood. They are going for it. Bishop e6, nice move. Now I need to see a little bit of this. You know what's the best move in the bond cloud, by the way? It's actually going... Oh, it's not that, because bishop takes pawn. Wow. Yeah, actually going back to e1 is the best move, but orbital misses it. Frank's going for the grab variation. Y you can't play the bond cloud and the grab in the same game. Frank, don't go here, because then... Cause, oh, Frank, I just... I... <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! Does Orbital see only the knight threat, or does- I feel like Orbital might play knight takes pawn here, just giving this up. But I don't know, maybe- okay, don't take that, Frank! We'll don't do it. it! The F2 pawn is under fire. Yep. now the best move is probably still to go pawn to D- Okay, it's a nice move, but will Orbital find knight F2 here? If he doesn't find knight F2, he's in huge trouble. He could also guard his knight with a pawn, and then does Frank know about en passant, or is that too cheeky for him? He, he did tell Orbital in one of my comment sections that he was going to passant him, not en passant. Okay. So I, I, I can't confirm if that's any evidence or not. Damn, that's... that's a, I've and, never heard that before. That's why I love Loilo Chess, because I learn things about chess as well. He's going to passant him. Why doesn't he... Oh, Bishop C... That's not a great move! Pawn to... Okay, Frank okay. can block... Oh, it's made it one! Bishop F2 on the board! Does Robert see it? Silence has fallen over the crowd. Oh, he's missed it! Knight F2! I'm going British for the commentary as well! This is absolutely bonkers! This is absolute travesty as Orbital doesn't see he's that he can- the But but actually this is still bad because Frank's queen is trapped. Oh, but Bishop Orbital takes queen. It. Orbital does not see it. Bishop takes queen. Bishop takes queen on the board here. It's right there. Oh, and he's oh. found it. And he's found it. Maybe queen b5 check though. Orbital could hang the queen. But, oh, he just castles. Yeah, that's this the is, thing. This is a solid performance so far by Orbital Racer. He's come out swinging. He's ready to prove to the world that he is the ultimate dirty dog. Oh, he's such a dirty dog. Strikes in the center. Yeah, I, it's a little late for this though. You know what I mean? Like his queen is gone. The king is out in the open. You can only yell cheeky so many times that at a certain point, you do have to play for a win, though. If and, Frank uh, were here right now, I know that he would say it's never too late. Look at this. He's going for the knight sack on F6. Oh, oh my goodness. Pawn takes. Good move. Good move. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, knight F6 I uh, would, would be great. It would be really nice if... Uh, just a lot of pressure building up here. It's, it's not looking good for game one. 129. Oh. oh, no. He does get the cheeky fork. But I don't know if that's going to help. Yeah, queen takes d3. And then queen d... Oh, my God. Uh, it's mate. King e1, queen d1 is mate. Are we going to have a result? Queen d1 checkmate on the board. Does he see it? Oh, he's missed it. <laughs> King takes not okay. Okay. Oh, he's okay. lost his queen! No! Knight takes queen! What are you doing? Frank, take your time! Oh, Frank. Frank is going for the flag, but he, he still might make it. But, oh, God. Oh, no. Bishop takes rook now. Oh, that would have been the, the Botez gambit. 
Oh my gosh. Now it's made on F2. Frank has to go rook to E2. The only move. Will Frank find it? His rook is hanging. Rook E2. Frank has been studying defensive tactics all week. I did speak to him. He's had many dumplings before this game. <laughs> and that's not going to do it. Oh, game one is in the books. On the board. Game one goes to Orbital Racer. This is not looking good. No, that was a uh, rough showing from Frank. He managed to blunder, checkmate, and won two times, and his queen. But it's only game one. Uh, they can hit rematch. They can hit rematch and keep going. It's game yeah, two, Orbital Racer's Orbital Racer has the white pieces. Yep, Orbital's white. You got a big win. Now, I hope Frank's got, you know, he, he bu buttons, bu buttons uh, the shirt a little bit. And uh, all right, no King E7, Frank. Please, no King E7. Let's play real chess. Frank, right. the, oh. The Beautiful. cheeky four-move checkmate from Frank. Oh, he's going to allow the opportunity. Bishop C5? Bishop Wait. C5. Bishop C5. What? what doing? Frank, you... Frank, this is not our opening prep. Frank, damn it. You prepped Frank? He's been studying the Dutch. Why is an Englishman studying the Dutch? I don't make the rules. You don't make the rules. That indeed. Bishop B4 check. Frank has lost his opportunity. Okay, Frank, please don't take everything you see. Please don't do it. Appreciate all the gifted subs. Uh, the easiest way to subscribe is if you already pay money every year for Amazon to get your packages faster, hit subscribe. It'll say a little prime sub there, all right? And that way you avoid the ads because uh, I don't run them. That's not up to me. Uh, Frank's, knights, Frank's knights are just grazing on, on the rim of the board doing absolutely... I don't want to say nothing. They're, 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 they're doing f*** all. They do f*** all, Sean. They're lurking. They're lurking. This knight is coming to G4. It is, actually, yes. By the way, Frank, beautiful stuff this game. Beautiful stuff. Much more solid. If, and I don't know if, I'm sure you guys have noticed, but Orbital has played the exact same setup with both colors. He's going for the, the outside light squared bishop and then just closing it down and just developing his pieces. This is going to be hard for Frank to oh, break what? through. Why did he just hang his queen completely unprompted? What? No. Oh no! Oh. This oh. is a bad. This is bad. It's much harder to win in chess without a queen. Oh, Frank! No! Oh, and his Frank bishop is melting under the pressure. I cannot believe it. Oh, this is tough. This is tough, folks. Oh my goodness! The first two rounds seem to very clearly. Be in Orbital's favor. Oh, gosh. We have people guessing the moves on the livechess.com board. Guys, if you are guessing over 50% of Frank's moves, you need to do more puzzles. Yeah, if you're managing to predict what Frank is going to play, that is, uh, that, that is impressive. Because I got to tell you, I, I, his moves uh, strike me as a, a Russian roulette. Uh, and uh, there's a bullet in every chamber of the gun, it feels like. Um... But yeah, you can, uh, you can actually play Guess the Move on Chess.com. This is not like me, you know, it's not an ad. You, you can watch any game on Chess.com and then guess what move is going to be played. It's fun to do that if you watch really good players. It's also fun to do that if you watch Frank. Cause... If anybody predicts an entire game that includes that, Frank, ooh. That hangs a knight three different ways. <laughs> like, that was, Sean, that was literally the worst square to move the knight to. Like it, it, Anybody it, guessed knight b3. If you, if you, you guessed that he was going to play knight b3, you need therapy. That's what you, you need. You need, you need medicine of some sort. Yeah, that's... Frank's got to just relax a little bit, I think. <laughs> oh, what's he... What? what is going on? Man. He wanted to double the e pawns to get more central control. See, now he doubled orbitals pawns. <laughs> We did study. We did study middle game tactics. The knight. The knight should have. The knight's going for the h2 pawn. Please, please no. Please don't it's take. It's loose. Okay. Okay. Always play f6. I. You know, I'm not upset. Frank is blundering. All right. These guys are at the level you're going to blunder a lot. I'm upset that Frank is making it so easy. I hope Orbital doesn't play queen e6. Have you ever oh. seen anybody lower than 127 elo? Unfortunately, yes. Wow. Yeah. I cannot say I have. Yeah, queen, queen takes rook. I mean, Orbital's playing clean this game. You could tell Orbital's quite good. What? Somebody check Orbital's 
uh, other taps. This is fishy stock fish play. Nobody can play this well against Frank. I well, I, I was gonna say that, but then you know, um, yeah, then then, then Rook C one happened. Um, yeah, uh, it's made in a couple moves here. The queen and the rook should just swarm. Another way to win here with white is you just pick up all the pawns, but. When the king is left alone like this, just get as close as possible. You'll checkmate by accident. Like, literally. I mean, you can play queen g. You'll checkmate by accident here. He defends the knight. Solid move. Uh, any rook. Okay. Uh, now any rook move on the board is a mate, basically. Because queen is going to come. Do we get a discover check? And now f5, Ooh. queen f5 is, uh, yeah. You could win this game by accident because black just doesn't have... Nice move. Wow. wow. A knight, a discover check from the knight to end game two, guys. Wow. This is not looking promising. It's not. It's not. Oh, yeah. Orbital is showing that, you know, there is a level difference here for sure. Uh, he's tactically very, very good. I mean, and by tactically very good, I mean he's managed to take a free queen twice, which is all you need at this level, frankly. It should, it should be a crime that Frank loses ELO after these games. Yeah, it, he's losing one point, which is kind of insane because they're 500 points apart. Like, if I beat someone 500 points below me, I would not be gaining points for it. Uh, there's no cheating going on. Uh, I, I know it's hard to, to, to swallow, uh, you know, your favorite uh, UK personality losing, you know, like Patty Pimblet did to uh, Jared Gordon. But, uh, it, you know, I, I think Orbital's just been a little bit better these first two games. But I like Frank's opening now. If Frank just keeps developing, I love this. I don't. Where was this Frank the last two games, Sean? Frank's. I don't know. He's got the he's got the London system going without the bishop on f4. But that's it's much better than the king on e2. I think yeah. this is progress if I've ever seen it. Yes, and I, I you know I think two games in a row now Frank has lost the bishop uh, a queen to a bishop. Last game, he lost it to a dark squared bishop. This la first game, he lost it. So if Frank just trades off Orbital's bishops, I think he's in good shape. But that's see now, look at this. Orbital's attacking the center. E4 is a fork, and that's quite cheeky, as some would say. That if, is a cheeky fork. If Frank doesn't take anything here, he's going to get forked. He's going to be losing immediately. So he's got to deal with this right now. Everybody look at the engine eval bar. We do have an advantage for Frank. That is not a bad move. He's going after the knight. I like the aggressive strategy. He wants to close down the center. See, if, if he was tactical, he might play like a bishop b5 here trying to pin. It's not, you know, e4 is good. Yeah, g4 is wow. not, g4 is not a bad move, but again, king safety. He might take that bishop. He might play no g5. No kings are safe. We don't need king safety. We need tactics. We need, we need a, we need a checkmate. He's not going to win. He's very. He's not well sound in end games, but he is well sound in tactics. We need to play to our strengths. He okay. Got, okay. He, I, I, he's not sound in either. I'm not going to. He lost two queens in two games. Like, what do you mean? See, he's sound in tactics. Those <laughs> were accidents. They That's happen. Right. Everybody true. blunders. That's true. Actually, Frank is winning if he finds bishop takes bishop. Bishop takes bishop is winning Frank. because the Frank. queen takes the knight. Oh! Ooh. Always look for captures. And he closes down his bishop's scope, and we are back to an equal position. Yep. Bishop takes now queen out. You got to always scan for captures because you never know. You never know what opens up. Every time a piece moves on a chessboard, everything opens up. Other pieces can see now. Oh, Frank, please don't go queen e2. I, if Frank goes queen e2, I might shut the stream off. There's no way. <laughs> okay. He's all, like, this is, this is the Mikel Tal type chest that we want to see listen brother somewhere mikhail tal is buried underground and uh he is uh he he is gagging at what you just compared him to but uh no oh, oh don't take that pawn take this one it's free get the cheeky fork get the cheeky <sighs> h4 frank, oh, frank. Oh, he oh, oh but he's got he's got him scared he's got him scared running backwards he his pawns man that's what he does he gets he gets in your face he's gonna play g5 if, if he's worth his weight in gold he's gonna play g5 let's go frank Frank, all in. Oh, he's found it! We'll take it. We'll take it. Come on, Frank. <gasps> he found 95. Oh, my gosh. Frank, I, Frank, don't do... Give me a cheeky queen f3 here. Oh, Frank, please, for the love of God. Queen f3, Frank. Let's go. Get that queen out. But queen d7 at the end is not a mate. He might make that mistake. He might go bam, bam, bam. Frank, That's please. Okay. okay. Oh, pawn takes pawn. Qu queen f7! Queen f7, Frank! 
Frank! Frank, please. Ow! Frank, damn it! Queen we'll D3? Take... What's gonna happen? Frank. Don't. We need orbital. No oh, I, was, oh. I, I think I jinxed it. I was gonna say we need him to not castle. Oh, oh, but fork. Hold on a minute. It, it, That's a cheeky fork. If if orbital plays bishop g8, he's cheating. He's, if he if he plays bishop g8, pinning the knight to the queen, he is officially cheating. There's no way. There's but no way. Yeah, yeah, there's no way. There you go. That was the uh, that was the cheating scan, and he did not Let's find the move. Let's go, baby. And Frank is winning, but his king is very weak. And in chess, the two uh, most important there things. There are no pawns at home to defend the white none. king. Zero. And in chess, and we got a lot of. Back. We got a lot of newbies watching, so I'm just going to tell you all. Material and king safety, two most important things. Oh, what a move. That's not what? a bad move. Queen e6 after this. Yes, queen e6. And the only... Oh, queen e6. Oh, please don't go queen g8. I, f Frank, I'm going to lose my mind if you play queen g8 here. Frank, this I is swear... A dirty dog of a move, queen e6 is. Yes, queen e6. But there's no checkmates because by, by some miracle of God... All the square. Oh, he's found it. Oh, King baby. D8, knight F7, mate. King D8, knight F7, back his mate. He might oh be afraid God. of a back rank, so he might go here, and knight F7's mate. Okay, he's blocked. That's a good that's, move. That's a, that's a solid find here from Orbital Racer. Now, Frank might not want to trade. Frank's got to speed up, by the way. He might lose this game on time. We have not seen anyone in time pressure just yet. He trades the queens. Yep, that's not bad. Rook, rook trade two. You trade when you're up. Push pawns. Oh, Frank, you got to move. Frank, you got to move. Make this a match, baby. That's, I love that. Classy stuff from the dirty dog. He doesn't care about the extended pawns on the king side. He says, my king is safer on G1. Let's get the rooks connected. This is, this is fascinating game. This, this really is. Frank is a full rook up. The only thing that will prevent him from winning this game is the time. He needs to speed up. And when you speed up, that's when you make stupid moves and blunder. My heart is, I wish we had heart rate monitors. I'm pushing, yeah. I'm pushing 150 right now, minimum. In, in, in the second edition of this event, we will. How about that? Knight f4 is a great move. Frank is definitely going to want redemption if this turns, if this event continues how it's going. <gasps> rook! Knight takes rook! Knight takes rook on the board! He's up two rooks! Frank, move! This is big. This is big. We gotta, we gotta pick up the pace. This is in the bag. Now, what you do here with white, I love that. Trade the pieces. You can sack the rook for the pawn and the bishop. It's okay because you're up so much. Just don't let the pawn through. Stop the pawn and take it. Stop the Frank, stop the pawn. Oh, God. And then you've got to trade and promote. Don't take. Bishop back. Oh. Bishop Come on. back. Frank is under a minute. Frank is under a minute on the clock. This is not an easy position to win in a minute if you're 125 ELO. On the board. Oh, my what God. Move? Sean, we might be looking at a 2-1 score. He is playing phenomenally. Look at this. Now, Bishop takes Rook is the best move, but now Black has nothing left. If Frank takes Frank. all the pawns, at least he makes a draw. Rook Frank. in. Take everything. Go, 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 go. Come on. Frank, let's make a move. Take the pawn, damn it. Me Frank, too. you know how much money I got on this match? None. But next edition, we will. DraftKings, holler at us. I did reach out to DraftKings. They did not respond, unfortunately. You gotta get me to do it. I'll listen to me. Oh my god, Frank, take all the pawns. Yeah, Frank, take all the pawns. <gasps> Sack the rook. Sack the rook. Oh! Frank, Fra Frank. Sack the rook. Frank, go, go, go. Yes! Go, At least the draw! The He's got 20 seconds to make two queens and deliver a ladder mate! Oh my, Frank. This might be the most clutch performance we've ever seen. Does he know how to ladder mate? I think he does. I think he knows how to ladder mate. Frank? We gotta go. Maiden two. Yes! It's on the board! Two to one! Frank! That and is that is a plus 27 ELO for that win for Frank. Oh my god. Oh my god, that is absolutely sensational stuff. That is absolutely sensational stuff. This is Needless bigger than Leicester City winning Premier League. Needless to say, that was a must-win game, folks. Being down 3-0 would not have boded well, and he came up clutch. Oh my goodness. Can I just say thank you to my this amazing co-host, Sean, a.k.a. Chess Tactics, named TBD, and this incredible audience. Look at this. 21,000 people are watching this right now. This is big. My heart is racing. This, this might be better than the day that I was born, and I remember that day vividly. You do?
I don't want to talk about it. That was rough, yeah? Sorry. <laughs> Castle, by, by the way, uh, honestly, I think that game just made the match worth it. <laughs> like, that like, game I, in itself. I, my heart, uh, heart rate got up to 170. I, I can't prove it, but that's a promise. Orbital oh, Race is coming out with a solid opening here, but Frank's got the momentum. My heart is, is pounding. Absolutely it, pounding. This is like top tier guess the elo but and we get to watch it live we get to watch it live the elo is on the screen and the, the thing that people have to understand is this is not an even matchup like orbital racer is 500 points higher than frank and frank just hung a knight <laughs> frank's chest knowledge is limited <laughs> wait d5 yeah yeah Maybe? Th th does frank i don't think he's gonna see that i think he's gonna play bishop if frank sees d5 i'm gonna lose my mind I mean, D5 is a crazy move. We've been studying middle game tactics. He might play H5, but D D5 is... D5 is crazy. I would guess Bishop A3 is coming. All right. Okay, yeah, that... I, I had the right piece. It's very might hard get, to guess these moves. Might get a little cheeky over here on H2. Oh my gosh, this is wild stuff, man. This is, uh, this is a good I, way to spend your Sunday. This is the only way to spend your Sunday. I hope, I, I hope someone out there right now is in church just sneaking in some, some viewing on their iPhone. Just, you know, yeah, yeah, Heavenly Father. Oh, my, oh Queen E5. Oh, my goodness. Queen, please don't go Queen H6. Please don't go Queen H6. Okay. Somebody guessed 10 out of 14 of the moves in the last game. I don't know how that's possible. This is a... Uh... This, this is wild stuff. Guys, remember, I know a lot of you watching are teenagers, so you can't actually give any money, but uh, this is a crowdsourced match. Like, the prize fund is whatever you donate, and uh, that was made by Sean. So you can use the command match, and there's the last link there. You can donate 5, 10, 100 quid, whatever it is. They can afford chess lessons with their winnings from this. Yes, maybe a mod can drop it in the chat. This is crazy. I did not expect 21,000 people to show up to watch this. And I think if all of you called a friend, we would have like easily 21 and a half thousand. All right. So it, no way, right? Orbitals, he's going to see this. Frank. Frank, you dirty dog. Oh. oh, he's found it. Checkmate has been stopped. That, that could have been electric to say the least. Frank has blocked in his light squared bishop. We have no real way of continuing this attack. Yeah, he would need to slide the bishop back, push the d-pawn, and sacrifice on h3, or play bishop g4 and hg queen h2, which is, as some might call it, cheeky. That is the cheekiest setup. I think Orbital's trying to stop it. He's getting this central pawn chain. This is going to be a hard chain after he plays e5. Frank is going to have very little attack. I want to see Frank play F5. I don't know if it's a good move or not, but I just want him to go for it. Yep, for, and obviously he would need to move his king out of the way, but also Queen E4 is uh, a free pawn right. Okay, Bishop F4, is, it's a move. Now that gets G the Bishop out of the way, yeah, and then now he can play, uh, get his light square Bishop out. Yeah, the Let's problem is it. that the Queen on her own is not going to do any damage, so Frank's going to get the Rook in or the, the, the other Bishop in. Queen on her own is not going to you know, do anything. And please don't go here. Frank, don't play queen d2. Swear to God. God, seeing a one by Frank's name is just inspiring. Yeah. If you've ever wanted to play chess and you think you're not good enough, guys, this is an inspirational story. Yeah, this is a spectacular uh, story. Uh, Frank is, uh, is, is, a, is a newcomer to chess. Didn't even know much about my content, which I, which I found heartwarming. W heartwarming, not warming, not like a dog. And, uh, and he was just telling me how, you know, he got into chess a little bit and he's been playing and he just says cheeky and dirty dog and yells a lot. And, you know, you guys love that. And that's, that's beautiful stuff. God, it's, it's revolutionary to say the least. Who knew that TikTok could be used for good? Why are they trying to ban TikTok? Look exactly. at this. Look at what we created. If they showed this match at Congress, at the congr congressional meetings, they would completely change their mind. Yeah. Who cares where your data is going? Look at this match. It's the, worth losing my data. You're losing your data anyway. You know what I'll I mean? You're a, just losing I'll it to couple, Instagram. I'll take a couple toll-free calls every now and then and get some targeted ads. 
to see this match. If Frank, plays, if Frank plays Rook, oh my God, he's still going for mate. I, and, and Orbital's Orbital doesn't know what to do. He's up a knight, but he's not using his pieces. That's the thing. He's up material, but it's all over here. And pa pawn takes, and there's a, a pin coming. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. I want to see G6 and then Black moving. Uh oh. He's got okay, to find Rook D8. Oh, He's got to find that. Fort plan. <gasps> Wait a second. Oh, this comes with. Oh, but the Rook is protected. Does oh, I didn't does, even see that. Does yeah. Orbital see that? Was that all part of his plan? Dang. Wow. Now Queen takes Bishop. Only move. Nice. There we go. But we have chances. Yeah, now the knight's going to come, and this is tough, but. If Frank speeds up, he could still win. Bring the rook. Pin the knight. Rook d8, best move on the board right now, Frank. Come on. There's very... Uh, just no pawns for Frank in the center of the board. There's no real action to be played here. It's, it's going to be tough to squeak out a win, but if anyone can do it, it's Frank. All right. Rook e8's not a bad move. Queen, okay, he's still got... Oh, and c5 has been prevented. This is crazy. That's a good move. Now, A4. A4, attack the knight. So when it moves to the middle, you pin it. Frank, A4 on the board. Only chance. Somebody gets Stockfish up here. This is, this is getting a little... They're getting a little too advanced here. Yeah, now there's... Okay, C5. Yeah, he's got to find A4. But that pawn's going to go. The queen's going to go. This might be 3-1 orbital. This is not looking good, guys. This is not looking good. What was the, what was the first mistake this game? How did this start to get out of hand? He, he hung a knight in one move is what he did. <sighs> oh, he's setting up... Ah, I thought he was going to set up pressure on the F2 pawn by playing rook F6 and then targeting that. Frank is very good at spotting these kind of like weak spots near the king. Queen C7. Now queen D7 is kind of lights out. Orbital's playing sharp. You got to give the man credit. I know everybody loves an underdog story, but, but Orbital, is, he's... Studied. He's done his puzzles. He's come ready to play, and he's executing. That's all you can ask for out of a professional athlete. <laughs> professional athlete, indeed. I love it. He's going to compete in the next uh, iteration of the esports Olympics. You saw Chess got added to that. To the esports? Did it really? Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness! Frank should play Queen B8. It's a cheeky move. He's going to lose anyway, so he might as well just fake attack the queen from far away and That's, hope I that yeah, Queen E5. And I like the idea. I like the idea. We got. He's got to understand that this will not be won positionally. This has to be won with cheap tricks. Yep. C7, you just take the pawn, though. Queen B8, you also take the queen. There's still ways to lose. But, uh, yeah, knight B5. And I would go queen F5 here. You're going to lose anyway. Sneak in a take on the queen. Okay, queen C5. Yeah, this is not looking good. This is not looking good. Yep. Pawn is rolling like a ball down a hill. Very hard to stop. Yep, yep, yep. But it's, it's not, you know, white still has to f get it in there. And, you know, with black here, you're looking for tricks and you're looking for perpetual check. And unfortunately, I, just saw, Frank's, I saw Frank's clock and I thought it was orbitals. I almost got excited for a second. Yeah, C8, oh, no. and that's it. And that's, that's, yeah, that's game. Wow. What a good comeback game from uh, Orbital, who takes a 3 1 lead. Oh, that's check. That scared me for a second because I was like, yeah. Can't Frank just take? Trade the B1? Yeah, there we go. Wow, that's a flex. Queen F5, board vision, defending yourself. And, uh, He's pre-moving. He's gone into pre-move mode. It's this game is not over. Knight, okay, Knight F7 was mate, but that's Our GG. Our first flag. Wow. I, I, if I know Frank, and I, I think I do, I think he's in, a, he's in a good mind space right now. He's not letting this rattle him. He's, he's taking it all in. I think he's starting to, he's starting to get comfortable in the, in the spotlight here. I'm comfortable in the spotlight. I feel like this is a, this is a spectacular event we're, uh, we're putting on here. Three to one is the score between Orbital Racer and, uh, and Frank. And by the way, Orbital just lost the pawn on the second move here. 95 It, it is does just... not matter, though, because he's been... Oh, I thought Frank had been studying the fried liver. I thought he was going to go Bishop C4. But if you get a free pawn, you should take it. Yeah, now the only drawback is that black... Oh, no, now pawn to D4 is just winning for white. All right. Oh, he's that's... going for the fried liver setup. This is unbelievable. This is this, this is also good. Now, Black's that okay? That's Take a that heck pawn. of a move to find. That is a good move. Yeah, pawn to pawn to d5 and okay, Frank, don't uh, panic. This is normal stuff. Black. Let's go, Frank. Now, don't take, don't take. You know, you got a castle or play queen f3. 
These are your two options here. <sighs> it's okay. That's you okay. Don't, you don't want to give up the bishop too early and oh. Oh no. Oh. The fried liver has been fried. Oh, orbital is yeah, now bishop here. Oh. We study this prep. Wait. If orbital doesn't trade queens, if he plays queen takes c2. <gasps> he hung his queen. He hung his queen in oh one move. Frank, What's he Frank. done? Frank, please, let's go! Oh my god! Oh my goodness, he hung his queen in one move. God, no. This is Fra unbelievable. What Frank, is Frank, what are you doing? Frank, no, Frank don't move overly really stimulated by that move. Oh, I s Frank, Frank, no. Frank. Okay, that's a good move. Oh my god. Frank is completely like... winning. Frank is completely winning if he finds queen c4, bishop b6, queen c4, bishop e6, queen sack, rook here, rook c8 is mate. Uh, if Frank. Rook c8, queen c4. Oh, I, I have a really bad feeling about this position, Sean. Every move in this position that doesn't hang a queen, we'll take it. We'll take it. That's we'll a take good that move. move. We'll take that move. Anything that does not lose the queen back is a brilliancy. Yep, Frank's got to get the rest of the pieces out. When you're up material, you got to use it. That's what a lot of people forget. He might go queen c4, hang his queen. He might go here. You got to use the pieces. Knight c4 is not a bad move, but... He's going for the attack with two pieces. We... we... Wait, what about what? What is rookie eight? Oh, that just hangs a rook. But okay. but after knight c six, now it's a problem. So he's got to find queen e six and take the bishop. Does he see that? Oh my god! This oh is, my uh, god! This match is just absolutely living up to its potential. Free Frank bishop. has got to finish this game off strong. I don't want to jinx anybody. But god Frank damn it, Frank! Does Frank see that the? Oh. <laughs> I can't even. I, I'm in pain, man. I'm oh. in pain. I'm in pain. I can't. I. Oh man. Oh, my, heart, it, it, my heart actually hurts. This is not a joke. He hung his queen. He hung his knight. He's hanging everything. Every um, piece. He's just... Every right. piece is falling off the board. Pain. Pain. Oh my goodness. Knight tried to get too cheeky. Too cheeky with it. But, you know, the king run strategy is legit. Like, what's going he's on going right now? To, he's going to attack the king with his king. Yeah, no, the king d5. Yup, yup. Listen, I made a video about this recently uh, where if in the middle of the game you just run your king up the board, people get really confused. Like, there you One piece down. One piece down. It's a brilliant strategy. Now, I don't know. He might blunder something else. Of course, it's losing, but it was losing even before that. All right, king c5. Don't hang the knight. Frank, go king c5. Thank you. Knight f7 is a threat here if Orbital yep. does not see it. Okay. That's a, that's a good move. Wow, King D4 though, King D, wow, Rook D6, King E5, and we're really cheeky. I think he sees it, okay, he does. Bishop A3, there's, there's no, no way. way. There's no way he finds that, there's right? There's no way, there's no way, Bishop A3, there's no way. It's still not, ugh. Yeah, yeah, there's no way. Tough. This is a heartbreaker, guys, this is like, this is like. Wait. I, I can't think of another significant Sean, event that this is analogous Sean, to. Sean, there, there, there is one hope remaining back rank maybe. oh my gosh frank identify put it in orbitals back rank now here 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 that's it and he lost the bishop he's got to do it in a way where there is no like right now f like that can be bl okay he sees it he sees the threat okay just keep dancing keep oh is he gonna get ladder mated oh, he's over the ladder mate we oh. can't let this happen. No! Oh, no. Oh my gosh, he's going to get ladder mated. He has to play king b8 and block. Ugh. Oh my, the ultimate... What? <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, just well played endgame. Oh. They should, they're going to write books about Orbital Racer's endgame. It's just too strong. Oh man. Frank had a plus 17... Valuation up a queen. We can't afford to lose those. He was up a full queen with a devastating attack. And now he's got to play with the black pieces. This is 
This is a momentum buster. Folks, I compel you. A lot of you watching this right now maybe have a chess.com account. Maybe you don't. You should make one. It's 100% free. When you bring the queen out, you have a responsibility to the chess gods and to yourselves to make sure the queen does not get taken. The way you need to think about a chessboard is every piece has eyes. You got to look at the other piece's eyes and see where they're looking. Frank's not done a good job of that. He's lost three queens in five games. As a matter of fact, Frank's only developed piece right now is his queen. Okay. Yeah. And knight, knight on the rim. That's, that's more than a queen, but. And Frank plays chess in a way where it's like the literal definition of insanity in the sense that he does the same thing over and over and it doesn't work. <laughs> he keeps bringing it. He's got to learn a better black opening. Now he's all right right now, but last game he went knight g4 and hung it in one move. If he does that again, I, I don't know what to tell you. You know what I mean? Ooh. How can you root for a guy that's not setting himself up for success? Get the I knight out of here, Frank. I'm, I'm trying to remain as unbiased as possible, but I think, I think if you weren't rooting for a Frank comeback right now, it's inhumane. Yeah, because nobody wants to see... You know, when you play someone and you, you know you're going to win, that's bullying. We did not know that. That is why we are cheering for Orbital. Yes, he's a favorite, okay? But favorites exist all the time. So, Frank, get the king to safety, damn it. Frank. Oh, oh that's a good move, by the way. Is he going to hang a fourth queen in, in six games? No way. I'm going to throw up. Oh, my God. <laughs> what? Frank. There's Franklin. Frank. Frank. Orbital is just. Oh, he's sharp. I got it. He's, he's good. Oh, my God. He's yeah. going to win this game in like. Yeah. Yeah. Are we yeah. On the, we're on the 16th move. Queen c8, bishop c5 is. Oh, my God. And queen d8 mate. I don't know if he got very lucky here, but. Queen, queen d8 is checkmate. Does he see that? This is unbelievable play from Orbital Racer. This, if you're a Frank enthusiast, wow. you are... You're sweating right now. This is... Orbital's halfway there. This is, this is no time to dilly-dally. Wow, this is, this is sensational stuff. This could be the match right here. And Frank! Frank's, that was not the Frank's time! Frank's given up. Frank has given up, unfortunately. Frank, we, need is... to, we need to get the composure back! Get the, leave the queen on D1. What are we doing? That's tough. Yeah, that's tough. Uh, he's just better. You know, you know what, what would really be a fun story arc here? What? Would be if Frank took some lessons and came back in like three to six. Is he going to hang his queen again, by the way? Frank. To, to bishop takes queen? I think in five out of six games. I mean, but can we just say it's kind of fitting, yeah? I mean, British I, queen... The odds of probability are just not there, even for Frank. Yeah, this is uh, this is tough. But I think credit has to be set. Uh, Orbital's very good. He's a very, very good player. I, I think Orbital's played today at around like an eight, nine hundred level. Yeah, he's 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 just stealing. Oh, I guess he, Orbital, regardless, is going to be down Elo on the day because that one loss was like minus twenty seven. Yeah, that 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 game was uh, that that was a tough one. That was a th that that's what it's going to come down to. Well, folks, look. Uh, maybe you came today for, uh, for like a very tough match. Maybe you came for a 6.5, uh, you know, 3.5 or 5.5, 4.5. I'm sorry. We didn't get that. We didn't get that today. Um, but you know what we did get? Probably the highest ever viewed low ELO match live. I think that's what we got today, and you were all a part of that. So this is, you guys are all a part of history. This is this is an unbelievable event, and I I don't want to say it's over yet because you not never over. know what can happen. It's not over, but it but you know, um, folks, there are forty year old chess grandmasters that have dedicated their entire lives to this game, and here we got Frank and Orbital who have I don't know spent a collective six months playing this game. I don't know how long Orbital's been playing, and they've got more viewers on this game than lifelong chess experts have gotten in their lives look at that you know who we got to thank for that sean because you put this match on levy I, I respect i respect you giving me credit but this event would not have been possible without these two brilliant brilliant men um i'm, I'm just the moderator i just i just put it put it together but this these are the guys that the crowd wanted to see uh, it's unbelievable that we were able to make this work and i still believe frank has some juice left in the tank he just needs to find composure he's uh oh. Okay, that's not the composure we needed. 
but this this is not this is not good. This is not good. Absolutely not good. This is um, not good. <sighs> that's tough. That's tough. Okay. That's it. That's the match. Orbital Racer. 6-1. Like a tennis match. A convincing win. Wait, is that the match? You said it's first, isn't it? Oh, is it first to 10 or is it best of 10? I thought it was first to 10. You're the organizer. I, I, the, the event is first to 10. Ah. Let's see, well, if, uh, let's see if they... I, I think. Don't ask me. I, I'm just here to, to talk. <laughs> I find it so fascinating that prior to 2020 and prior to like this whole recent chess boom on TikTok and, and short form content, there have been people who have dedicated decades of their lives to these, to these pieces and these squares. And like 400 people would watch them play a game. Look what we got here for Frank versus Orbital. You know what I think? I think this is more relatable. I, I think that's I think what it is. I think that's exactly what's going on. People, people can't really follow the high level stuff even when they want to. And it's just like, they wanna, they wanna know that they're a part of this community. They wanna see top level personalities playing like they play at home. And this is, I don't know if people play like Frank at home. I'm frankly scared they to ask. They do, for sure. They this do. is comforting content, if anything. I looked over at Twitch chat. Everyone's been super supportive, but I saw one comment that said, we don't relate to this. And to that person, I say, of course you don't, because you are even worse than this. So how this about that? This um, is true. I, you know, I, ha I, had a, I had a big brain content idea. Have you seen Physical 100 on Netflix, the physical challenge elimination show? No? No. It's like a bunch of really jacked. Uh, it, it's, it's based in Korea, a lot of athletes, you know, men and women. And I thought, I'm going to take a bunch of uh, chess creators, uh, or streamers rather, not chess people, just ch streamers in general. And I'm going to do that. I'm going to do like an elimination style show. And if either of these gentlemen would want to be on that show, I would be Maybe. happy to have them. All right? Would, I, I'm, I'm digging that idea. This, this is, we need to get chess at this level into the public eye as quick and as large scale as possible. It's, it's, Couldn't have said it better myself. Like, I've been thinking, you know, we start with a round of 32 and Magnus Carlsen plays a simul against all 32 people at the same time and the last 16 remaining who do not get checkmated move on to the round of 16. I mean, can you imagine XQC, Ludwig, Moist Critical, we'll get like Mr. Beast in there, I don't know what his day rate is, and then you got Frank and Orbital playing Magnus Carlsen in a simul, surviving until the last 16. I mean, it, this, this is, is This epic. is content. This is what the people want to see. Of course, they don't want to see uh, Anish Giri versus, uh, you know, Fabiano Caruana game 74 in Tata Steel. Although they do want to see that too. Um, speaking of which, I know that this is the People's World Championship. Folks, in seven days, the actual World Chess Championship begins. Like, the champion of the entire world. Um, Magnus is not playing because he, he gave away his title. Oh, good move by Frank. He didn't, he didn't lose his queen this time. Now he's got knight takes bishop. So... I was I was scared of I was scared of mate there on d8. If he missed it. <clears throat> now 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 he's good. Frank uh, he he's playing a lot better this game. I don't this want to jinx it though. More of, an, more of an equal position. We have equal material. It looks like this is this is one that Frank needs. If Frank doesn't blunder the queen in the opening, then we have chances. We need to convert. You can't blunder a queen if it's not on the board. So my mom always taught me. <clears throat> you are right. A hundred percent right. Who do you think is going to win the world championship, by the way? I think, uh, I think Jan Nepomnishy, uh, the gentleman from Russia, is a slight favorite. I think uh, he's been there before. He played the last one versus Magnus. He lost, but this time his opponent isn't Magnus. A lot of people are asking why Magnus is giving away his title. Uh, personally, I think it's because the prize fund for the world championship hasn't gone up in 30 years. That's back rank mate. Rook D8 is back rank checkmate. Oh, that made me sick to my stomach. It's a fork. But it's back rank mate. Oh there no! It there it is. I'm gonna and throw up. Seven one, Brazil, Germany, all over again. A cheeky fork was just. He had the right. He had the right heart, the right mindset behind it. But yeah. I can only imagine his reaction on his stream. Gosh.
But I think we do have to remember that Orbital is a 500 point favorite. Like, if I played a match and I'm 2680 Blitz, if I played a 2180, um, I, I, I would, I, if, I, if I was even only up 7 1, I would be mad. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, hard, it's hard to gauge the emotions by their play, but it's, it's hard to imagine that Frank has some positivity left in him. We're all praying for Frank. He got his account banned. This is his revenge arc. And it's not going well. This yeah, we, is... we, we have to remember, Sean, Frank is worse move three like every game. I don't know how his queen always is developed. Yeah, first... it, you know, and, and Orbital's good enough. Like, he's, a, he's almost at the level of a fully formed beginner. Like, like, 800 is where you graduate from beginner to early, early intermediate. And he's just not blundering any of this stuff, you know? Yeah. Like, I mean, I don't like that move, but even that move is good. And now E5 and Bishop C5, like, he's playing pretty good. I got to tell you. There, there's only so many times you can yell cheeky and dirty dog, but at there's, some point, you know, you got to face the music. There's no limits to cheekiness. It's just when the cheekiness is blundering pieces, then it's not so much cheekiness. Yeah, exactly. I don't know how Frank's queen got on H3 exactly, but he, he, he's not very mobile from that square. This is like excellent stuff. Knight e5 is actually, it looks like a good move, but now knight f2 is a fork. And again, you're just getting punished for bad development. That's, that's all that's happening here. He's Queen not going to fight that. He's Queen not going to fight that. You don't think so? I think he's going he's gonna to say the queen's not on d1, so it's not a real fork, and forgetting that it's still a fork with the queen on h3. Oh my goodness. Yeah. He's playing out of his mind. No, that, oh my. Oh no. Frank. You know what would be really disgusting if Orb... This is a double check, by the way. And the only move is King H1. And now Queen D4, smothered mate, Knight F2. If, if that happens, I'm turning off the stream. We're going to have to... It's not a bad move. Oh, oh. Okay, we're going to. Yeah, okay. Yeah. That is not smothered mate. That might have been the most incredible move ever played in Guess the Elo history. Now, oh, does, does he find this in Queen H4? No way. No way. Oh, he just that's finds Queen H4. Move I yeah. thought he was going to play. Yeah, 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 yeah. I and he's blitzing he's... these moves out. Orbital yeah. did not use two minutes in that game. No, he didn't. No, he's, he's full of confidence right now. Uh, unfortunately, the chat is now looking for excuses for why Frank is losing. Frank is just losing because he's getting outclassed. I mean, it just happens. It just happens. I, uh, I, 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 you know, I want to avoid uh, any of this silly stuff. Like, uh, you know, he's cheating, this and that. No, he, he's, ju he's just been the better player. There's not even enough time to stream snipe. Because to stream snipe, you have to listen to us say something, and 15 seconds later, you have to do it. He's not doing that. He's playing moves he's, much faster. He's just, he's just better. That's all. Frank, I don't know if, if Frank's listening. You shouldn't be. But if you are, leave the queen at bay. Oh, my gosh. That, that's better than the queen coming out, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Listen, I, what I really hope for is this doesn't demoralize Frank. Like, losing sucks. Losing a lot also sucks. He's just, the, 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 the solace that he has is that he's just the worst player. Like, that's okay. You can be worse than someone at chess. You can change that. You can then improve. For example, I'm worse than some players, all right? If I trained a lot, maybe I wouldn't be. But like, where, where chess hurts is, imagine you play against your friend who has never played chess before, and they beat you. That sucks, because you're like, what the fuck? I thought I was better. Queen f4, by the way, is a free bishop. Orbital is making mistakes. We right? have an advantage. Folks, we have an advantage. But the queen is out, which is the most dangerous thing. Yep, and he could lose it in one move. It would not be the first time. Queen e4, good move, nice. That does not lose a queen yet. See, I think Orbital did not play queen e2 because he, knew, he knows that a queen trade is good for Frank. He wants yep. to leave his queen on the board so he can take it. But it's just a matter of time. Queen, queen you know, he's going to play castle because he's principal. Or, or fork, great. But black, yeah. is still, black is still quite the advantage here. Queen takes g2. And he hung his queen in one move again. Frank! It, it, what I are mean, you it, doing? It, re it really was just a matter of time. I mean, it... it... Guys, this is not cheating. <laughs> this is just... 
Frank. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's just a matter of time. You know what I mean? It's and and Frank's just gotta. The good thing is we've identified the problem. You know, like when you know you know when you go to the doctor and you don't know what's wrong and it's scary. We know the problem. All right, like we've we've diagnosed him. He's got a problem. All right, he's just he gotta not, stop. We need to make a rule that he cannot move the queen until move 15. Yeah. What I used to tell my students, I used to teach kids who were five and six years old, if they play too fast and blunder, I would say, sit on your hands. Sit on your hands at the, at the board until you're ready to make a move. That's what he, he just can't move his queen. He's just not allowed. He's not allowed. This, right? is un so, this is unbelievable. It's crazy. This is, uh, you know what? If I was Frank's coach, I would, I would not let him play again. Like, I would just call the match. Like in boxing, you know, just that's it. Throw in the towel. You don't have it today. How much, how much will coaches be charging for these uh, training sessions with Frank? Because I think the stress alone is going to be quite listen, the premium. Listen, I, I, I'm, I, might, I might do a coach stream or two with Frank to give him a few coaching tips. But the thing is, you don't even need me right now. You just need to stop f***ing blundering the queen. You know what I mean? Like, I... I could be your personal trainer. I could yell at you to stop blundering the queen, but you got to just stop f***ing blundering the queen, man. Like, <laughs> is that was that eight out of nine games, or is that seven out of nine so far? He's hung his queen literally every game but one. I mean, it's unbelievable. Like, he, won. he won the game. He did not blunder his queen. Yeah, but it's mate with a pawn. No, no way he played. H4 mate would be the most vile thing I've ever seen. Yeah, so you see, there's no cheating going on. If he played H4, that would have been sus, but he's just taking the pieces and yeah. Um, a lot of mates here, a lot of mates, a lot of different mates. Yep, he doesn't find it, it's okay. He see? found a mate in nine instead. He's calculating too deep. Listen, uh, this, uh, this was a case of just level difference. It's all good. Frank's just got to, you know, he's just got to get better from this. This is going to be a hard one to recover from. I, I have, I've been in these shoes before. Anyone who's ever played sports, anyone who's ever gone through trials and tribulations, they know the pain that comes with losing, especially at this magnitude. I mean, we're praying for Frank. We're going to get him all the help that he needs and deserves, and he will be back better than ever. I promise. I, I, I give you guys my word. That's just mate and one right there. And we're going to the potential final game. And yeah. I feel sick to my stomach. I'll be completely honest. Yeah, I, uh, I've unbuttoned my top button. You know, like, I, I'm, I'm, I'm taking a much more casual approach here. Like, I just hope Frank would... Like, th this is... When I said... When Frank won game three, and it was 2-1, I knew it wasn't going to be a close match. But I knew that he won a game, and I was happy. I did not want it to be 10-1. I mean... <sighs> I don't think anyone could have predicted. I don't think anyone could have predicted hanging your queen every single move. Also, Frank has gone for multiple bong clouds. I don't want to see King E2 here. I want to see some grit and some fight. He yeah. needs to go for the fried liver. That's his prep. You know, there, it has never been a better time to improve a chess. There's literally so much information out there. You can, yeah, he's just going for scholars, mate. But there's so much info out there on how to improve. Like, Orbital's faced this a ton. You know, he's 600. Yeah. And he's going to play some night move. He'll develop. Okay. And he doesn't even stop it the best way, but it doesn't matter. All right. The first, the first step in every chess player's journey is finding out how to stop Scholar's Mate. Maybe he's letting Frank get back into the game a little bit later. <laughs> Maybe he's just mocking him. Yeah, but see, now that's it. You know, this is all you did. Now Black is going to finish up his development. Like knight d4 is a good move. He did retreat the queen. He re the queen did not stay there on h5. This is progress. The good thing is that when you're like 126, the world is your oyster in chess. You can learn so much. Um, and uh, you can you know, turn into a sponge here. We need to queen c4. Oh my gosh, it, he's going for the reroute. Scholars mate. This might work. This might I think work. he's gonna play. I think this... he's gonna play d5 here. I think he's gonna play d5. Ah. Oh, but queen takes bishop. Queen takes but that that. For, Frank, this was the whole point of... Okay, take one of them. They're both free. Two free pieces. He's spoiled for choice. Good. There we go. Damn. There we go, baby. We have another advantage, but again, his queen is in enemy territory. I don't know how this keeps happening. Well, this time at least I'll give him, the, you know, I'll give him props because he's up a bishop. This was actually very, very nice. He might come back. He might if do he it. Wins, if he wins the next nine games... 
I will take out a loan and donate it to Frank myself. That's a promise. Frank. I, 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 couldn't, I couldn't explain the euphoria if he came back. Yeah, he's just not... But it's crazy because his whole opening plan was about that square. And he's just abandoned it. He's just not going for that. <laughs> he's going uh, night. And he just immediately hangs a knight. And, and I, I, I fear he's going to like hang some... I mean, the queen is just... Every square is mined like in Minesweeper. Frank, you got a castle, man. Okay, Bishop G4 threatens mate. We might be looking at the last few moves of this match. Can't queen? Be. Okay. <laughs> queen. I'm so scared that he's just not going to... Okay, okay. Every time he has to move his queen, it's like a, it's like a coin flip if it's going to stay. Yep, now for, oh, he's still not castling. Normally at the beginner level, you see your opponent castle, you go, oh, oh yeah, that's, that's right. You know, a lot of beginners do that. Again, like he's going to go here, he's going to get his queen just x-rayed to his king. I mean, it's c5, rook e8. Rook e8 looks strong. <sighs> yeah, it's a good move. It's just a matter of time. Eval Bar is not liking this position. Orbital Racer has just been phenomenal. He is, his pieces are always active, always in the center of the board. Yep. Good principal chess. Like, at the end of the day, the difference in level in chess is at any given moment, you are going to make a better move than your opponent, and he's made better moves nine times out of ten. But that's... That's mate. Wow. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, the match has concluded 10 to 1 for Orbital Racer. I'll be honest. I did not even expect this much of a blow. I was expecting something around 10 to 4, 10 to 5 for Orbital Racer. I didn't want to leak my predictions, but this is just absolute domination. I, I don't know what to say. So Orbital, for now, is the undisputed world champion of TikTok chess.